I wonder if you recognize these. It's a copy of the metal teeth that we made for Richard Peel, an actor, in 1976, quite a long time ago now, for a film he was in, a James Bond film. This character, Jaws, became very famous, and these teeth, or a copy, these are a copy, were made very famous. When we got that call from that dentist in 1976 to make this set of teeth, we didn't really know what they were for. We made them very big, we made them very heavy, and they were very, very uncomfortable for Richard Keel to wear in the James Bond movies. Now, if you're going to make something to be worn in the mouth, and I've been making things like that for 30 years now, you want to make them the opposite of these. Richard Keel can only wear them for a few minutes in filming, um, but for a denture or a snoring device, they must be the opposite. They must be very light, very small, and very, very comfortable. Otherwise, you will not wear it at all. So, when we make our anti-scoring devices, uh, this is a small bond, it's the opposite to these. Very small, very light, and very, very easy to wear. Because if it's not, you will not wear it at night. And if you don't wear it, you will not cure your snoring problem. 